What's up, YouTube? This is Jonathan back here. Um, if I'm doing a follow-up on the Ultimate Paracord Survival Bracelet, I uh, posted a video the other day um, on this one, the black one, and had some comments wanting to kind to want me to kind of go through and show how I put it together. Um, I'm actually going to change the way I do this one here, the the next one, because um, this one you can see there's some places that are really thick, and I'm going to try to even that out as I go around. Um, so basically this is a chapter two of it, um, but just a quick rundown. I'm going to show everything here, what's going in it, and then I'll, you know, take a break and then I'll put some of this stuff together and then I'll come back and then I'll show you before I actually start to braid the, the actual bracelet itself and I'll just have to do a couple of quick videos in the process. Um, but, uh, again, um, these here are your shrink wrap your heat shrink tubes um, one will hold your um, fishing kit which will be the three hooks with a leader um, the three swivels and then the BB size sinkers and then the other one will hold your magnesium fire rod and your uh, surgical blade is what I use um, then you have your whistle buckle these were the buckles that I was waiting on uh, these are a little bit bigger um, the, you can see the difference in the buckles um, of what I had and what I'm going to use. Um, this one actually has a whistle in it. Um, also going to use some jute twine, excellent source of uh, tinder for fire, you know, fire starting. Um, this is your picture hanging wire, your braided stranded wire. Uh, there's about 36 inches of that. <coughs> Excuse me. And then this right here is uh, single strand I think it's 30 pound wire uh, it's gonna have some electrical tape uh, about six to eight feet and then 35 foot of uh, braided poly um, 15 pound strength uh, fishing line this here is your saw and your fire rod striker this is made out of a hacksaw blade um, drilled two holes in the end and it's it, the bent if you get the flexible kind you can contour it to your wrist and it won't break uh, you'll have to excuse the uh, homemade band-aid I cut the piss out of my thumb earlier today um, and what I also do um, this right here this is I'm going to use this color because this is the color I had um, open and I didn't want to open another pack of paracord this is the blue camo or whatever you want to call it this is exactly 25 feet here um, and what I'll do is I'll make the bracelet and then I will um, if I have to cut any off I'll tell you know then I'll know exactly how much is in here um, Inside of here is, you know, like I said, I'll, uh, I'm going to put these together and then I'll come back and show you. Um, but basically what you're going to do is you're going to take your swivels, your sinkers, and your hooks, put them inside this, and then heat them with a lighter, and it'll shrink that up into a tube. That'll be one. And then this one here will have your, uh, your fire striker, your fire rod, or your actual just your fire rod, and then the surgical blade, uh, razor blade, will go in here. And I'll heat that up with a lighter and it'll shrink that up too. Um, but I'll be back in just a few minutes and show you. 